Hello, my name is John Schmidtke and I'm a sales consultant for Nevco Sports. Beginning next year, the NFHS will be implementing a new rule that changes the bonus foul shot scenario. High school basketball teams will now shoot two free throws when in the bonus, eliminating the one and one foul shot. This change to rule 4-8-1 awards two foul shots for all common fouls. Teams will reach the bonus when their opponents commit five fouls in a quarter. Team fouls will then reset at the end of each quarter. Previously, Teams were awarded the one and one bonus when their opponents committed seven team fouls and a half and two shots when 10 fouls were committed and a half. In accordance with the new rule, Nevco has detailed a step-by-step -step process to adjust the settings for your MPCW7 and MPCW6 controllers. If you aren't certain what model controller you have, please refer to the link below for a breakdown of each controller. Let's start by covering how to adjust the settings for your MPCW7 controller. Press options until your display reads automation. Press yes to enter the automation menu. Press options again to scroll the automation menu until you're on auto bonus. Press yes, the display will read auto bonus question mark. Press yes to enable or disable. The display will then read auto bonus question mark asterisk. The asterisk indicates auto bonus is enabled. Press options again and the display will read single bonus. Press yes, then enter the value 5. Press options again, the display will read double bonus. Press yes, then enter the value 5. When desired value is entered, select yes to confirm. To automatically display bonus or double bonus on scoreboard when 5 team fouls are reached. Press options until you read automation, then press yes. Screen will display auto bonus. Press options again until screen shows auto increment team fouls. If the asterisk is on, the bonus indicator will automatically appear on the scoreboard when the fifth foul occurs. If the asterisk is not on, press yes to add asterisk. From there, you'll want to save your profile. Back out of the automation menu by pressing no three times until you see basketball. Press options three times until you see profiles and press yes. Press options one time until you see save profile, then press yes. The profile name listed will be the last profile loaded or saved. Make sure it is the correct profile you want to save. If it is not, enter the correct profile number and then press yes. Press yes one time to validate the profile. Your W7 will give one long beep verifying your profile is saved. If you use multiple profiles for basketball, make sure you repeat the process for all applicable profiles. Now for MPCW6 controllers. Please note that these are set to automatically light up bonus at seven fouls and double bonus at 10 fouls. In order to comply with the latest rule change, you'll need to turn your auto bonus setting off. In order to turn off the auto bonus, first, go to set options menu. Next, select off. Lastly, you will need to enter your bonuses manually to five. That's all we have for this video. If you have any further questions about the rule change, please reach out to your local NEFCO rep.